Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing a get ready with me. Um, I first started off with the Nivea soft, but I, uh, soft cream, but I will go in with a little bit more because like I was doing like some house chores after. I took a shower um, and I let my hair like air dry for the most part. I do wear the hijab, so whatever I do with my hair, obviously nobody sees. But I still make sure that I do my hair. Sometimes I'll just throw it in a bun, but then there's days like I'll straighten it or I'm not going to show you guys today because obviously I can't show my hair. But for the most part, I do my hair. Just rub that in. I'm going to my parents' house. Um, I'm going to go hang out with them for a little bit. So I decided to film a get ready with me. Um, I'm going to first go in with my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in the shade Cream Beige. I think this was a little too dark for me, but I, I forgot because I was using the CoverGirl one for a couple of days. I think it was, but... Alright, we could look sun kissed. And pounce down in there. I got this mirror from um, the Dollar Tree. Um, I was there the other day, and oh my god, this is not my shape, but it's okay. I'm not doing a full glance. Get your neck, girl. You need to get your neck. Then I'm gonna go in with my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Concealer. I feel like I'm doing like a whole Wet n Wild thing today. That I love that company. It's so like affordable and like girl. Especially when it goes on sale, like buy one get one, uh, fifty percent off or whatever. It's like. It's already so cheap, and now you want to give me 50% off? Like, we could be best friends. We could be best friends. So that's it for that. And I'm going to take it with my regular uh, beauty sponge that I use for my foundation and just pounce it in there. Sometimes I feel that this concealer dries up. So I would go in with my Mario Badescu spray and just spray it. Spray my face. Oh, I'm running out of that. Spray my face and continue it. It wasn't that dry today. I just showed you guys like what I would do if it's dry. If you guys ever like wanted to use this concealer and felt like it was dry. Then go on to the side with the foundation and blend the edges out so it's not harsh. Because you will have harsh edges. And blend it out fast. That is nice. Then do the regular T-zone. And then, like I said, edges so you don't make it harsh. And then here. Okay, and then with the leftover, whatever it is, I just swipe my eyebrow, my blah, blah, blah. I just swipe my eyelids. I want you guys to give me like makeup ideas, like like challenges, anything, anything that. Oh girl, what is this? Anything that will be fun, like to watch that you guys want to watch. Let me know so I could I could do it. I'm trying I'm trying to like think of different ideas. I have a couple like I made a list, but I want you guys to like tell me what you want to. I'm up to 37 subscribers, guys. Like, you guys are doing it for me. I was thinking of it the other day. I'm like, like, literally, like, three days ago or whatever. I was like, why didn't I do this when I was, like, younger? Because, like, I really wanted to. And I had the equipment back then, too. Like, I had more makeup because me and my sister shared 
and I had more space to like since like right now like I'm married whatever I don't have a makeup station because I just never thought I needed one but now I do so husband you're listening to this you know what to do um when I was like living in my parents house with my sister we had a makeup station like we had like a whole thing a rack of makeup and all that and it was like she's okay with it i'm okay with it because we both love makeup like at that time i wasn't working like i worked in the beginning and then at, at one point i just stopped working because i was focusing on my school and my sister was the working one and you get the gist of it she was buying most of the stuff so when i left the fair thing is i don't take majority of it because she's the one that purchased most of it you get what i mean then i'm gonna go in with my brows i'm not gonna do too crazy today with the brows because like i said i don't really want a full look just to fill in the like that and then i have like a space right there that's it and then this part i almost forgot i didn't set my whole face what the hell I almost just ruined everything right now. I'm gonna go in with the powder and pounce it in there. I like saying pounce, not bounce. It just sounds more like makeup artisty, you know? Girl, how did I almost forget to do that? Okay, and then I'm gonna go in with my brush that I always use because I have not changed it. I washed it, but I have not changed it in over two years now. Go in with my Too Faced uh, Medium Deep Bronzer and start off like with the contour line and then build it like, like you see that? Like I started off like this and then I'll swirl it in like, it like defines the contour line and also bronzes at the same time. Like you don't have to use two different products. You see like that and then swirl then there we go it's just bronze when i first started making youtube like this is probably gonna be like my, my sixth video or whatever i thought oh, like i had to be so formal and i'm like like i had to be so nice not nice like i'm i'm a nice person but like, i mean like polite polite is that the right word i don't know i don't know if i'm using the right word but i had to be like like straightforward, um, put put this on, put that on, and that's it. Like, I wanted to do like a little chit chat. Like, maybe I'm just talking too much. Then I'm gonna go in with my Sephora colorful eyeshadow. Um, it's Lucky Penny. Yeah, it's like one of those single shadows from Sephora. It's really pretty because I literally, when I'm like doing my makeup fast. I will just take this with my finger like that and just pop it on my eyelid and it looks like I put like just shimmer obviously but it looks so beautiful look at that like I don't put no other shade like this is it this is it I don't know if you guys could see it like in camera it's not showing like the beauty of it as much like maybe I'll take a picture or something I'll go in back in with the same brush and I'm gonna add some blush to this. And I like to add, like I said, on my nose, my forehead, just a little bit like that. And I go in with the BH Cosmetics Carly Bible um, collab. Guys, this is the palette. Like, like I'm gonna show you how damaged it is because I use it so much. Like, it is damaged. Damaged goods, though. I love, I love, like, I hit pan on four, five things in this. Like, I never hit pan because I don't know, man. I don't know. This is just too beautiful. I'm gonna go in with the, um, the highlighter that I hit pan on. This highlighter, guys, is beautiful. And they have like different like shades for like different skin tones. Like it is, 
it is so beautiful so i'm gonna go in with this one on my fan brush and put it where you want mm -mm -mm. same girl i love when like i'm feeling myself like i'm like hyping hyping myself up like i don't need nobody hyping me up i can hype myself up like i love it and everybody should have that in them i didn't have that I did not have that a long time ago i'm gonna use my nose my finger for my nose just do that that then go in with a little bit and just dab it on the tip of the nose like that and then Damn, girl, you is looking finessed. Um, I'll do my lips, and then I'm going to do my mascara off camera. Um, I'm going to go in with the Wet n Wild Gone Burgundy and just fill in these crusty things. Uh, like I said, fill in... like that like fill in most of your lip with it the nyx cream liquid suede in the shade tea, tea and cookies i mentioned this before i'm gonna buy a lot of new products because i need to build my collection i'm gonna place this on top like right there and then i'll show you what i'm gonna do then i'm gonna go in with a clean brush these are from wish I'm gonna go in with that one and I'm just gonna paint it on, like mix it together basically. Like, let me show you the difference between the top, like that's the bottom, that's the top. Like using a brush for your lips, a lot of people think it's like weird but it's like what the makeup artists use like when they do your makeup i'm gonna go in with my essence and i'll do this off camera and then i'm gonna go in with my i don't do much coats when it comes to the first mascara which is the essence because i go in with the better than sex mascara and this separates my lashes and it gives it more volume so i just throw that on for the fun of it i guess And that is it guys that was my makeup for today i will be doing my hair off camera and um putting my hijab on and i will check back in with you guys and that is it guys that is my overall get ready with me i did my makeup um i put on a hijab i have the shirt from uh kohl's i believe i got it years ago it used to be a dress years ago and i wear it as a I wear it as a shirt now, regular jeans, and my Puma sneakers. And uh, that's it, guys. Uh, please comment, like, subscribe. Um, I say this in every video. Love you guys, and I hope to see you next time. Bye.